Music is beautiful and cathartic, but there is something very healing about explicitly saying what happened to you and speaking your truth. I'm still in my own journey of body love and self-love. I was molested by my father at a really young age. You don't, you don't know what's happening, especially when you're raised in that environment and your brain is forming, there's a sense of what normal is. I was untreated with bipolar disorder. I was really living in extremes of like, I would have the best day ever. And then I'd come home and I would want to die. When I was 16, I snuck into an army barracks <laughs> and I was gang raped. You kind of go into survival mode and are like, okay, how do I navigate this situation? And then I came out in the church when I was 17 and then I attempted suicide when I was 18. Everything hurt so much. Music for me was like survival, was a form of healing and almost like self-therapy. The fact that I was like abused by my dad, was raped, was gay, was bipolar. <laughs> Not to mention like always being like a big girl in the world, like just existing in those spaces of like, I don't feel at home in my body, I don't feel at home in this world. Like, what options do I have left? And you can only write so much. You can only sing so many songs until it's like fucking at your door, you know? I mean, I really value that, that moment of like holding the pills in my hand and like this thing in my head, like just stay here, just stay. You have something important to do and like being frustrated with that voice, like fuck you voice. I'm so glad that I didn't die. I'm so glad that I'm alive, that that I didn't I didn't give in, you know. But it wasn't easy. I mean, I feel like there is this sort of like canned way that we talk about trauma, this canned way that we talk about suicide, and that, you know, if you just go to Spain and you're on a boat and you eat tapas, and like there's your healing, you know, like real healing is like shitty like it's like it's dirty and ugly and not easy there are so many of us dying for healing and dying for community and hopefully in some way i can help facilitate that with the platform that i have and make music and make pop music i don't know <laughs> just do whatever i want <laughs> It all works out in the end. If it hasn't worked out, then it's not the end. And that's something I tell myself too. I wish I could have told myself that. But 17-year-old Mary was gonna do whatever the fuck she wanted to. <laughs> I'm Mary Lambert, I'm 28 years old, and I'm a babe and so beautiful.